Hey guys, this is Anon, and today is going to be a little bit different. I'm not going to commentate these games because there is just a lot that we need to talk about and kind of get caught up on. Uh, recently, ha I was very fortunate to hit the 5,000 subscriber mark on YouTube, and I cannot say thank you enough to you guys. It is uh, amazing. I really just started this channel trying to kind of fill the void. There weren't a ton of people producing content, and I don't think very many of them um, had necessarily a unique voice. It was a lot of just gameplays, and so I, I put a couple up and just started talking to people, both in my clan and on the forums, about what they wanted to see and where they could use the most help, and, and just far and wide, everyone just kept coming back to the idea of getting in the, high, in the mind of a Unicum. So I really just spent a lot of time trying to decide on how that works best, and have really structured a lot of this channel behind that concept of trying to give you the best insight into how I process games. Um, I mean, there, there's a million different st game styles and Unicums and, and everything out there, so I certainly do it different than other people, but I've just uh, tried to help as best as I can by providing kind of that mindset and, and do it in a few different ways. I mean, recently you've seen some huge changes at the channel with the format of the videos and trying to get more in-depth with kind of how I process uh, each tank individually and the stats and the armor profiles and things like that. And I know everyone, not necessarily everyone loves the changes, but I think overall they've been really well received and I did it mostly because it was uh, an extremely requested kind of format to take on and I think that uh, I'm really happy with it so far and, and I'm curious to see where that changes and, and kind of goes forward. So again just thank you guys for all the support you've given me uh, through this first gosh year and a half. This channel's not even that old at this point so I feel like we've just uh, been able to grow really quickly and uh, hopefully I can continue to have a positive impact on the community. Um, because of this 5,000 subscribers, I've decided to go ahead and give, do a nice simple giveaway. Uh, I'm a little bit busy right now in, in real life, and I'm going to talk about that a little bit here in a second. Um, so I can't do anything super, super crazy. So we're going to keep it really, really simple. On this video, all you need to do is comment uh, in, the, in the section below. Tell me what your favorite video is that we have created so far. Um, and what video you would most like to see moving forward, um, mostly uh, focusing on a tank, uh, I think specifically, not, not something crazy right now. But tell me those two things. Also, give me, make sure you give me your in-game name so I make sure you can get it. Uh, the one catch, unfortunately, is the way Club Wargaming is set up for North America is I can only do giveaways for North America. They're working on changing that in the future, but unfortunately for right now, this is only going to be a giveaway for North America, and I'm really uh, sorry for all of my uh, international uh, fans and supporters and subscribers, um, but I will make it up to you as soon as they make that available to me. So, what do you win? I'm, those comments are going to be entered into a random drawing for one E25 tank. I figured that was very timely after the buff. A lot of people are really enjoying that, and it's a pretty rare tank. And also a T3485 Victory, which is still one of the most sought-after uh, premium credit grinders in the game. And so one of each of those tanks I'm going to give away. You have basically a week to do it. Um, you have until midnight Eastern Time on April 10th, which is essentially a week from now. And then I will do a random drawing and make sure you guys get those tanks. So uh, sorry it's not a little bit bigger giveaway I wanted to. Um, but I think there's going to be some bigger stuff coming up uh, here shortly in the future. Like I said, stuff's getting moved around a little bit, and so I'm just a little bit uh, limited in what I can do with it right now as stuff transitions. But um, you will see definitely more of that coming in the future. Also, there's going to be a lot of changes, I think, to both the channel and just kind of the community presence moving forward. I wanted to launch it all kind of right away, but we're actually going to, I guess, kind of bring it out over time over probably the next few months. But you're going to see a lot of changes, things like uh, Discord channel to have better uh, reach to me and to be able to communicate with each other and uh, team up and learn and do a lot of great things with that. A uh, Facebook page is coming. Uh, I have a Giphy pay channel that I've been building that is really, really cool. Uh, that lots of uh, <laughs> kind of uh, fantastic moments uh, captured in space. So uh, that stuff is all going to come soon-ish. Um, and why I say soonish is because uh, personal life, we're go my wife and I are going through some pretty major changes right now. We just uh, made the commitment and decided to move from the Midwest where we are now to uh, the LA area in California. And um, 
I actually work for myself, so I have contracts uh, here where we're based right now. So it's going to be this drawn out process of moving and buying a house and moving a business and all this stuff over the course of the rest of the year. And uh, most dramatically in the next month and a half, because I have to get our house ready to sell. We weren't planning on this move, but decided to do it. And it's a big... Uh, a big change for us so that's part of why you're seeing a little bit less content from me right now and you're going to continue to see a little bit less probably for the next month and a month and a half or so uh, i hope it's not much longer than that but unfortunately right now uh, my time is just uh, committed other places and so i'll still do what i can I i'm hoping to not fall below at least one video a week um and below two streams a week uh, which i've been able to do so far but we'll just kind of see where it goes um, so bear with me a little bit with that. I, I appreciate all the support uh, as we're going through it. It's going to be a fantastic change for our family, and we're really excited about it. And I'm hoping once stuff settles down is when we can start to make those really big changes and additions to uh, both the channel and the stream and everything I've been talking about. I think it'll be really uh, kind of a cool thing and uh, allow a lot more kind of reach to the community and uh, also give you guys a little bit more reach to me. Uh, I'm never going to be someone that's a huge necessarily chat warrior uh, I think people that know me, and especially uh, in the clan or on our clan's Discord, know that I'm not going to, I'm not there and chatting all the time because it's just not my personality. Um, but I like to try and be as available as possible and at least answer questions whenever, uh, whenever they come up, as long as it's not excessively repetitive. <laughs> uh, I definitely uh, don't necessarily have the best tolerance for that. So. Um, just kind of keeping it real for you with that stuff and like I said trying to give you kind of a heads up and what you can expect uh, right now and shortly coming in the future and I, I do think it's a lot of exciting changes that um, that really couldn't have happened without you guys and without all the support we've gotten so far um, so I'll, I'll definitely continue to appreciate that. Um, other exciting change, I just upgraded the uh, laptop, so, and last night was the first stream on it. Um, we delayed a little bit because I had some bugs, but after that, I think it was uh, the quality to me after going back and looking at the replay is significantly better. Uh, a lot less lag, a lot less jumping around. So if you haven't been following on Twitch, um, be sure to get on there because we've got a lot of really honest stuff ca happening. Uh, uh, one of the comments I get pretty frequently in videos is that they're all these spectacular games um, and I'm not showing how it really is. Well, those are really how it is, but uh, yeah, I still lose plenty. Uh, I still have plenty of bad games. I have plenty of bad teams. Uh, a lot of what I do is just about trying to minimize those bad teams as much as possible and do the best you can. Uh, but on Twitch is where it is all 100% real. Sometimes I'm platooned, sometimes I'm not. There are days I will loot, win every battle of the evening, not quite as often as I would like, um, and but plenty of nights where I get <laughs> really angry and have to cut it off soon because I'm winning 40%. You know, so it, it's just natural. It's what happens with the game. It's an online game. It's a live game. So that's all just kind of par for the course. So be sure to watch on there and uh, hopefully we can continue to expand that venue as well. So hopefully uh, this wasn't too rambling for you and this was definitely a bit of on the personal side. I don't talk about that stuff a whole lot, but I wanted to share with you guys what was going on and hopefully you can appreciate that. So um, get commenting for that contest. I'm excited to give you guys a couple tanks. Uh, excited for everything that's coming up, and uh, we'll see you guys soon. Thanks.